Hello, uh, all my amazing subscribers. How are all of you doing? As you may have known, I have not vlogged since New Year's Eve. And to many of you, that is a really long time. Because it is now uh, the middle of May and I haven't vlogged since. I can explain about that. So, back in like January, February around there, I was dealing with some um, personal conflicts and drama around the beginning of February. So, I have been, I was kind of like not sure or about my vlogs, I guess, for a while. But then it was finally time for Valentine's. And oh my gosh, I had the best Valentine's you could ever think of. It was amazing. I loved it. My fiance spoiled me for Valentine's as always. Got me flowers, got me a plushie, he took me to Red Robin. It was great. We saw the movie Sonic because it was that movie was just releasing during Valentine's. So I'm like we both enjoyed it very much but and if you want to see my valentine pictures here they are here are the wonderful pictures of me and my fiance during our amazing valentine's date we had such a great time and i love the gifts that he gave me for valentine's i'm such a lucky girl anyway after valentine's see after valentine's okay yeah so every we everything started rotating into a weird everyone started gossiping about this weird covid 19 thing about the virus about where it started and at first when it started people started talking about it i thought it was like oh it's nothing and then people were joking about it like for example like did someone start playing the movie Jumanji or something? Because someone start, started playing the game and now we're all, everyone's getting sick. Yeah, that's a thing someone came up with when that started happening. But during the, uh, like, around the middle of, like, the beginning of March or close to the middle of March, it started getting serious. To the point where, <laughs> I haven't been working at my job since March 13th, so... As you may have noticed, I haven't been going to many movies as lately. Actually, I haven't gone to any movies since March. And I'm like, Aah! the last movie I saw was Bloodshot with Vin Diesel. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm just trying to give you guys an update on what I've been doing since then so yeah after the quarantine started um my boss recommended me to get unemployment so i was unsure about it at first but then two three days after i lost my job i was thinking hey why not so i wonder how that's gonna turn out and so two about two or three weeks later after i applied I started getting my payments for unemployment, so I'm like, yay, I, I'm not going to struggle anymore, yay, because I was almost broke before I got my unemployment, so, yay. Anyway, I hope all of you are doing safe and well during this epidemic, and somewhere around the beginning of April, or I think the beginning of April or the mid-April, I think, or was it the end of March? I think, I'm not sure. But when they announced that there was going to be no more uh, paying for Metro buses, like, you know, like you have to pay a dollar uh, each way or however much money you have to pay a each way, you know, like for adults, it's like 270 something or 250. Because I live in Washington State, like in like near Seattle, near Kirkland, that area. So... <laughs> I was excited to hear that I wouldn't have to pay for Metro bus fare until further notice, as they said. So I'm like, 
You could not imagine the look on my face when I found out. Oh my god, I was screaming in excitement. I was not happy about all the deaths that have happened since this virus, but I was just happy the bus was free for this entire quarantine. Like, basically, like, 80% of it so far. Oh my gosh, it's like a weight off my chest. And since quarantine has started, I have started to gain some weight because of it. And I'm not going to say what my weight is right now, but I'm going to try and get, I'm going to try for my goal and reach to about, let's say, give or take 200 pounds, probably before winter, hopefully. That's my goal right there, before winter, reach 200 pounds. No, not 200, I mean like basically like somewhere around there. Basically an average weight for a five foot, eight inch girl, you know? Just want to give you guys an update on what's going on lately and stuff like that. And so, still dealing with quarantine, but as of today, Monday, um, today's Monday, yes. As of today, the Governor Inslee has reported that everyone has to wear masks out in public in Washington State or anywhere, depending on where you are, until further notice to slow the virus and everything. And as you can see in this vlog, I am being very mature and very serious, like instead of all my other past vlogs. But right now I'm just giving you an update because all of you haven't seen me lately because I haven't been vlogging since January. So I thought, why not give me a serious look on the situation because I've been so, um, I've been having a lot of mood swings um, because I've been stressed because yes, I am living in a new place right now. I am started living at my mom's place since last June 2019. So since June 2019 till now, I have been living at my mom's apartment complex. But also, I am now enjoying a new social media app that makes me so happy. And I might start to lose weight with it or something. Or might, it might help me to lose weight, which is called TikTok. So I'm really, really happy about the TikTok app and everything. Because I've done so many fun videos on it. I've done, I've done a duet so far. I've, oh my gosh, I'm having so much fun with it. Please follow my uh, TikTok uh, channel and video and whatnot. I'll put it into the description below. Please Please follow me. I need more followers on TikTok. On TikTok. Please, please follow me on TikTok. I need more followers. I I know I have 130 subscribers here on YouTube. All of you amazing people. But I need more. I need the same amount on my TikTok channel. Please. Anyway, just letting you know I am doing fine. And here's my personal opinion on this COVID-19 virus. Wherever it came from, it will not see the light of day if one and once it meets me. And once I find it, or the source of it, I shall put it in a boiling of hot ash and lava and watch it burn alive. That's how angry I am at this stupid virus that has ruined part of my spring and part of my life a little bit. Besides the fact that um, <laughs> I have to wait till after uh, phase four of this COVID-19 thing before I can go back to my regular life. Let's see, um, I'm going to San Francisco for my birthday, but hopefully phase four starts before then so I can go to San Fran for my birthday, please. And, I'm going to have to celebrate my four, my eighth year anniversary with my fiance after phase four starts. And my very first time in 27 years, yes, I'm 27 right now, I'm 27 right now, I'll be 28 in August. Just letting you know, 
that when phase two starts, I will go to Jean Juarez and get a whole complete whatever, hair trim, haircut, whatever, facial, mani, stuff like that. I'm not doing pedicures anymore because of an incident that happened to me during high school, which I will not say unless you comment below or if you private message me on Facebook. All right, so thanks for watching all of my viewers and subscribers. Please hit the like button, comment below. Please let me know how I did and also please subscribe. I would really appreciate that because I am really, I am very sorry for not vlogging at all, but I have, have so many things I have to do lately, but please watch me on TikTok, watch me on Instagram. I am still very frequent on those and please follow me on Facebook or stuff like that. I will post those URLs down below in the comment description section. All right. So have a great day everyone and try to stay positive try to be happy during this crazy bug mageddon or sick mageddon whatever you call it or coronavirus epidemic whatever anyway have a great day everyone and i hope to see you again really soon and i will definitely be doing way more vlogs after phase four but for now i will try to do at least one vlog a week maybe two at the most i'm not sure yet but i'll keep you posted and i'll keep you updated have a great day everyone bye